Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we have my very first Stitch Fix box. I'm very excited because I don't know I've heard some things about them. I know some of their pieces can run a little bit more expensive um, but I actually have a $25 credit to spend on this box which for those of you who do not know Stitch Fix is a styling service. You get a stylist who styles to your preferences, you take a style quiz, and it's a little more in-depth than like the Indian West, which I decided to try them and I got the first one, which I did not record because I was just trying them out, but my next one I'm definitely going to record. Um, but anyways, for this box, the $20 styling fee that you spend goes towards your box, which obviously with my credit, I did not put any money towards this box right now. And they pick out five items personalized to you based on your answers from the styling quiz. So I'm very excited to see what we got in the box. I was like, I can't open it. I got to do it for the reveal. So anyways, my handy dandy scissors. And they do provide the return stuff. So return is no cost to you. But inside, which I'm already excited about, ooh, I'm seeing some nice fabrics. So this is what the inside of my Stitch Fix box looks like. You've got the return label and packaging already set for you. So I'm going to set this here to the side. And then, let's see here, got a little envelope. And it says, oh, hello, which unfold it, and which I'm not going to look at. It's got like a whole bunch of different things that they think would go through style. Re refer a friend, get $25 and $25 in credit when you share Stitch Fix with your friend's score. So that's kind of what I went and did. All right, your style delivered. Hi, Sierra, and welcome to Stitch Fix. My name is Marissa. Hi, Marissa. And I am so excited to be styling you. I like to think of the first fix as the getting to know you fixed. I pick some stylish pieces based on your profile, but over time and with your feedback, I will start learning all that you love. I saw that you were a stay at home mom, which I am. I've got three kids, so I'm very busy. So I wanted to find you some pieces that I think will be comfortable and stylish. This nine Britain wrap blouse is so adorable and will be great for throwing on with these one five one pants and tan booties for a comfortable yet chic everyday look. How do you feel about dresses? I think they're great for putting together a quick look and thought this Kylie knit dress would be so cute as we transition into spring. Pair it with this beige love Ellie cardigan on cooler days. Best Marissa. I already think I'm going to have a problem because cardigans are kind of like a weakness of mine. I'm over sweaters. I really am. But a sweater's got to be really cute for me to like it. But we'll see. Because I'm already like, oh, ho, ho, kind of thing. Which there's another card in here. Welcome to Stitch Fix. Here's what you need to know. Basically how to work with Stitch Fix. So that's really cool. And I really love her message. So let's see what's in my box. So this is what my pieces look like. Got some nice neutrals and floral. Floral is one of my weaknesses. I just, I can't resist. So I'm not going to look at the prices of any of these right now. And I will be trying these on as we go on. So I'm opening it and unwrapping it as careful as I can because I don't want to ruin anything. So first we've got, it's like a dictionary high rise pants. Ooh, and they're by Stitch Fix. Dictionary, but I'll hold them up so you can see like the end. It, they're very clean pants. I'm very curious about what these are gonna cost. I have quite a bit of pants. So they'll be interesting. But we will try them all on. They are so soft. I can't resist. Oh, there's another fabric in here I didn't see. Ooh. This is the Kylie Arnett Fox Wrap Knit Dress. And I love the fabric already. Now I just got to find it. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. Oh. 
She did a lot better than I thought they were going to do with my first stitch already, to be honest. And it's just two pieces. So. Ooh. And then we've got the, I mean, I don't know about the print. I'm not really sure. It's very cute. It's a blouse. It is called the Carvana Fox Wrap Blouse by Nine Britain. So, it's not my usual style. We'll see. So, next we have. Next we have. Please go play. Next we have the Pink Clover Luna Elbow Patch Button Detail Brush Knit Top by Pink Clover. Oh, I see the elbow patch. I'm not really sure about elbow patches, to be honest. But the material is really soft. I really like it. <laughs> so, we'll see. <laughs> I'm really digging that floral dress already. And then we got one more piece, which is by Love Ellie. It's an Audra Slice Lace-Up Detailed Texture Cardigan. Oh, that's not what I was expecting. But it's... Like a really pretty feeling. It's comfortable, which I got a lot of comfortable stuff. And then it's got this cute little like crisscross detail on the edge, which I think is really cute. So but I'm going to go try a couple of these on and I'll be right back. So this is the flowered blouse that I flew on, threw on. Uh, this is, it's a very pretty material. I'm not very sure about the floral itself. It's not like... I don't know. It's not wowing to me, I guess. Um, but I love the feel of the sleeve. I like that little flow feel. But it's very short. Like, if you look down, it's just... It's like hip length. And these are high-waisted jeans. So, obviously, these come up way past my hips. Um, it's very cute. It's not knocking it out of the park for me. Now, as for the jeans, as you can see them being high-waisted... They got a very cute front, but they're kind of tight on me. So I don't know. I may have to adjust my sizes. It was very like, eh, I'm not sure what to pick. We'll just go off the best that we normally do, which I'm starting to get in some more of the better shopping because I always went to Goodwill before. Um, but I like the pockets. I like the material. Um, the end, they meet very well. So it's very comfortable. It's not something that I'm wowed by because of the way it feels around my hips. It's squeezing really bad. Um, so, but I will be back. So I went ahead and threw on the cardigan with this very comfy shirt I have on here. Which I don't know how I missed this, but it's got pockets. And... It's really cozy, and I probably should not be keeping the really soft things, but I'm very tempted to keep this. And I've got enough lounging wear, so I don't know. This is going to be probably my weakness item. Now, as for the shirt, I think it's very cute. I love the button detail, which I got this little hangy thing sticking out here. Um, I don't really like the feel of elbow patches. Elbow patches are not my thing. Um... I think if I'm going to buy a nicer piece of clothing, I want something more to it than just solid colors. Something that I can't just go to Goodwill and find off the shelves. And while these are really nice brands and this is really soft, I still feel like this is something I probably could have found at Goodwill. Um, so I'm probably going to be a no for me on the shirt. Cardigan's going to be my weakness, but I will be back in the pretty floral dress. So I'm back in this cute maxi dress, and I am actually loving it. It's really pretty. It's got this nice feeling top. It's not too revealing. If you look at the side, it's got this nice tie, and then it's just about knee length. So it's very, very cute. Um, I don't know. I'm going to... I thought I was going to have more trouble picking when it came to the letter I read, but... I'm, I got my choices, but I will be back in a minute. All right, so 
I really loved this dress. Like, this dress is definitely an option for me. Um, the black pants, well, I really like them. They were kind of tight on me. Maybe I need to update my sizes. I'm not really sure, but not a go-to for me. Uh, so that's a no. As for the shirt, not a fan of the elbow patches. Very, very comfy. If I was looking for something to lounge around the house, this would be my go-to. Um, this shirt, I don't know if I got my size wrong. What what size is this? Um, it's saying it's a medium. So it really shouldn't have been this tight on me. But for some reason, it was just really tight. It was really hard to get out of. Didn't realize that until after I recorded in the shirt. This cardigan. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm really going to have to find these prices because I'm dying. And I got a $25 credit. So, I mean, it'd be very easy to be like, oh, keep the dress. It's really my style because it is really me. Um, I never thought that, like, green would be something that I'd fall in love with. But it is. Um, so, on that note, let me try to find the price sheet. Uh -huh -huh. Okay, so this is my price sheet. It's a good thing I did not look at it right away. So, the Kylie Arnett Fox Wrap Knit Dress, till green, size medium, it's $54. So, I mean, I do have $25 credit. So, I mean, that'd still leave me $25, about $29 for the dress out of pocket. Now, if you do buy all five items, you get 25% off, which is a really good deal. Plus, it does not take out whatever you've already put on the cost of the box and whatever. So that's extra, but I don't know. I'm still going to have to think about this. Um, the one, five, one Jody Pont high rise pants size six. That'd probably be why. Cause I'm a size eight. Um, those are $44. That's not bad. I was thinking they were going to be expensive. The love Ellie Audra side lace up detail texture beige. Um, that was $46. Um, the Nina Britton Cavana Fox Wrap Blouse is $42. If that had actually fit me, I would be all about it. Um, the Pink Clover Luno Elbow Patch Button, which is the pink clover. Yeah, that would be this. This is the cheapest thing in the box. It's $38. Um, stylist pick subtotal altogether would have been $224. If I buy all of them, which I'm obviously not going to do, um, it would have, would have taken $56 off. Order subtotal was $168 after that discount. Credit would be I have $25 credit, so that would lower it to $143 if I kept everything in this box. Which, for the quality of the items, it's not bad. I do love the pieces. Um, oh, I have a hard pick now. Do I keep the dress, which is more expensive, or do I keep the comfy item in the box? Oh, which is, what brand is this? I need to know, because... It's kind of like, what do I spend out of pocket? Love Ellie medium. Okay, so this was the Love Ellie, which is so cute. <sighs> Love Ellie was Audra side lace up texture, $46. So if I do my $25 credit, it'd be cheaper to keep the fluffiness. I might have to do some math. But I would love to hear your guys' thoughts, your opinions. Um, I guess I'll end up putting my decision down in the description box. Um, tell me which pieces were your favorite, and I would love to hear from you. But for now, see y'all later, and I hope you enjoyed my first Stitch Fix box.